There, guys. <clears throat> oh, my throat took me there for a second. Uh, today, I was planning on uh, playing some backroom skits. At least one. Start with budget backrooms and see uh, what that gives us. And uh, maybe play some other games as well. I did download three, three demos of three different backrooms games that's gonna come out in 2024, so this year. I'll uh, my PC to allow budget backrooms to do something on my PC, apparently. This game contains following loud noise if the audio is too loud for you please adjust the volume in the audio settings section in the menu main menu or check the volume in your os this game contains flashing light glitch effects and such if you have photosensitive epilepsy it is not recommended to play this game this game uses binaural audio it's recommended to play with headphones or speakers that support stereo audio channels. Everything you see in this game is still in development and it might not be final. Game could be popular, discontinued or still in development in the future. This game is not a one-to-one -one representation of the Backrooms wiki. Like any other Backrooms game, this game has its the own downsides and upsides. It is up to you to enjoy it. Click to continue. Nice! Hmm. Oh, I don't have any hearing. Uh, budget backwards. And the screen is way too big again. Oh! Wait, then I don't know. Nice. Oh, this is good music. I need to figure out who made this music. Is is it possible to do that in the game? Yes. This is real good music. Oh, let's try the game. Game modes. Classic. Maybe I should move my face there. Uh, classic hardcore. The me meme rooms or unsaved levels just let's just play classic experience the back rooms in its most authentic form with a classic game mode travel travelers through various levels and find the oh travel traverse through the various levels and find the exit while encountering strange phenomena and otherworldly entities the first level is guided by arrows on the wall I'd probably uh, turn your volume down there a bit so that you uh, won't be uh, too much get too uh, loud music things in your ear. <clears throat> Exit while encountering strange phenomena and otherworldly entities. The first level is guided by arrows on the walls but beware of no clip no clippable walls that lead to sub levels you're not alone in the back room so stay alert and keep moving okay game mode unavailable yet and the meme rooms even though i had no place to put game mode in title this is the meme rooms tm a goofy uh 
a refined experience of budget backrooms. I've inserted the 21st century humor, probably unfunny, into the game. Finally, after one year in development, I finally wanted to release one game mode. Mo modifiers. Followers. Followers out, replaced with net box. Next box chasing you like they're after a rare MFT. Stamina and less like the queue of toilet paper in the early days of the pandemic. Ooh. Player speed faster than my dad going for milk. Unfunny warning, proceed with caution, some content may be unfinished. Okay. Uh, let's let's start with the classic. Let's start with classic game mode. Press F to turn on your flashlight. Hold C to zoom. I can also run. Oh shit, okay, um, let's just, whoa. Oh shit. Press, you can pick up the flashlight by pressing E. Why is there a phone ringing? Quotes. Okay. Oh shit. No, I don't want to go down there. I haven't seen any arrows on the wall yet. Oh. In here? Oh, hey! Discover sub-level. Use the multiple levels to access the sub-levels. So now we're in the sub-level. Nice. Okay. Oh shit. Um, let's just push through. Oh shit, wait, okay. Um. Watch out. Oh, that looks like smile, smile dog. Oh fuck, let's run. Yeah, it's this level because he's right behind me. Oh, yeah, okay. He's um at least oh shit. Oh. in a giant uh, store lo lo logger um
isn't there a, uh, well, there is something. And it doesn't look like an entity at least. Okay, well it's up here though. Let's go up here. Ooh. Oh shit. Okay. Yes, loading. That is nice. And now we're in a long winding stair. Okay. So how long am I? Oh. Down in not that long. No, fuck. I died. Okay. Okay, let's 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 try this again once more. Maybe I should run from her. Avoid using this flashlight near smilers as it upsets them. Okay. Uh, Oh, yeah. Ah! Oh, yeah, and do not go straight into their face. Well, now we didn't use the flashlight, at least, though, at her. The other one. There she is. And now I'm here. Uh, wait. Okay. Is it straight through here? Or 
Was it Camilla? Hmm. Oh no, it's this way. Oh shit. Um, what happened? Where is she? Um, there she is. Um, is it? Oh shit. No. It is. There. Probably. I bet there's a smart letter here as well, somewhere. No? Okay. Nice! Nice! Just a couple of deaths. And not that bad. Just a bit jumpy. Oh shit. Interviews. Oh. So now the power is restored. Can't see any light though. Okay. door. Huh. How nice. I don't need my flesh. I don't need care. I have to get my flesh. Oh shit. What's happening here? A giant building. Go up there. I missed two. Going towards the right thing. Oh. Well, let's go down. What is this? A dark room. Let's go towards the lighting. I feel like smilers might come at any time. Or maybe anything else as well. 
Now we're in an office with a pretty dark uh, bleak outside. A U for sanity. Okay. Oh, I use the stamina and I can't get more. Level 5, hi there, would you like to sign my Patreon? Uh, looks like you're done here, would you like to contribute to the game and answer uh, to a 5 minute survey? Come on, it's not gonna hurt, be honest, as that's possible if you want. Uh, Sign my petition. This will open a link in your default browser. Should I sign the petition? I could. I could. Yeah, why not? Let's see what this uh, this thing is all about. Let's do this. Hmm. Budget Backrooms Alpha Stage Feedback Survey Budget Backrooms is a game in its alpha stage and uh, um, There we go Budget Backrooms is a game in its alpha stage and a solo d uh, as a solo developer I'm constantly looking for ways to improve it your feedback is incredibly valuable uh, to me and will help shape the future development of the game. This short survey will only take a few minutes of your time and will help me understand what you liked about the game, what could be improved and any new features you'd like to see in future updates. Your input will be used to make Budget Backrooms the best game it can be. GPT. I had no idea. What? Is this a game made by ChatGPT? I had no idea. I do, don't understand who made it. But I found it pretty fun. How did you find out about this game? Steam. Were you able to play the game? Yes. What did you like most about the game? What did I like most about the game? I found the... Um, the uh, areas to be pretty... Um, Pretty nice, yeah. Interesting. It also had a kind of um, what's it called? Um, creepy undertone. Yeah. So it had nice. Uh, yes, and voice, and had a pretty creepy mm. 
tone. What you did dislike most about the game? Um, what did I dislike about the game? Hmm. I didn't. I didn't meet any monsters except the smiler. Uh, I met few monsters. I met few monsters. Yes. Are there any technical issues or bugs that you encountered while playing? Leave blank if none. Okay, then I'll leave blank. Overall, uh, how do you rate your experience playing budget backwards? Uh, if you ask me, it was a solid 7. Yes. What additional features or improvements would you like to see in the future updates? Uh, he would like to see them. Hmm. What's it called? The um, pool area. Pool. I. But, but they might be there, but I might not have actually gotten through it. Additional notes for develop, de developers. Developer. Leave blank if none. Uh, next. Budget background. Oh, the next one. In this section, I just wanted to write some questions or possible future events that might happen in the game. If Budget Backwards was released as a paid version of the on the Google Play Store, how interested would you be in purchasing it? Uh, maybe a seven there as well. Indeed, because it was pretty fun. And if if it gets better and it it's not that expensive, like then yeah, of course. If multiplayer and also I feel like um, uh, the maker of the game does deserve a bit of money for uh, the time he made making the game. It does take a lot of. Uh, it is a lot of effort that's put into uh, making a game, no matter how small. If multiplayer was integrated into the game as a really early testing version, how interested would you be in testing it? Personally, I'm not that... I don't play that much uh, multiplayer games, uh, so that would be a 4. Next. 